Worldwide Day of Play. It's a day dedicated to learning through play and for kids, their families to get up and out and around. Our Janae Reese is on your corner. She stopped by the Star Spangled Banner Flag House to show us how they are celebrating. It's a day all about play. For the first time, Nickelodeon and the Association of Children's Museums are teaming up with Baltimore's Star Spangled Banner Flag House for Worldwide Day of Play. We're trying to get, just get kids out here and families out here uh, to play, to engage, uh, and just really have a fun time out and about. The Flag House is known for its rich history, but Saturday it transformed into Fun Central. You know, we know that movement and sports and activities stimulate brain activity and they make kids healthier, both physically, mentally, and emotionally. From playing 19th century games to crafts to candle making and more. Some activities and crafts that really engage kids uh, who come out and that way they can have a tactile uh, experience when they are at the museum. Because it's about having a good time, but also learning something new. And I find that it helps connect a lot of people to the area that's around them, to their community, uh, to their country, to their nation and all that. And it just helps make a more well-rounded citizen if they are engaged in history. Outside of Worldwide Day of Play, the museum hopes this will bring more kids out here so they can learn about history and, of course, play. For now, reporting on your corner, I'm Janae Reese for WJZ.